guys, just got a quick update video for you here on my MacBook Pro. It's something I was thinking about and toying about doing for a while now, to be honest. I got a message on the comments asking for an update on the MacBook Pro. So here we go, let's have a look. The MacBook Pro is a device that I really love. I'm using this computer day in, day out, and the things that I particularly like about this thing is the battery life on the computer is absolutely fantastic. I will get a good five, six hours out of a charge for normal use if I'm using any of my editing software it's substantially less because it does draw an awful lot of power. In terms of the battery life I'm really impressed. In terms of the responsiveness of it this moves like you wouldn't believe. It loads up so quickly there's no lag with absolutely anything on this computer. If I wanted to load anything at all up it just loads so quickly. I mean loading up Adobe Premiere Pro on my old laptop it would have taken quite a while to do to be honest we're talking maybe a minute possibly two minutes to load that thing up and here I've clicked on it and it is loaded up pretty much already there that's in what 30 seconds it loads everything so fast so I'm particularly happy with this whole thing now coming over from PC to a Mac there were a few things that I struggled with but nothing that I didn't overcome in a massively quick amount of time. It was unbelievable how user friendly this thing is and it's something that I really don't foresee anyone having any sort of problems with at all. I absolutely adore this piece of kit. It looks absolutely amazing. It is just so portable. If there's one thing that I'd recommend for this computer that you might not already have, one thing I'd recommend that will make your life so much easier, and it is getting one of these. Now this is a hub that plugs into the socket on the side, and what it basically does is it plugs into the USB-C socket on the side of the, the laptop, and it expands it, so you've got another USB socket here. I have a card socket which I find absolutely fantastic. So I can just plug my memory card straight out of my camera in here. It's got a micro SD as well in case you're using one out of a smartphone. And you've also got two full size USB sockets. So that thing goes straight into the side of the laptop here. And then you can plug your accessories straight into it. That is a lifesaver because I'll use quite often an external hard drive to store all of my footage from a camera on because I will not store anything on the laptop itself. The 128 gig of storage that it has is absolutely fine. But once you start playing with things like Adobe uh, Premiere Pro or Final Cut if you're video editing, it will store the footage on there but then the app will also use the footage as well so it is taking so much space up that getting an external hard drive is a must if you're planning on editing with this. Things like Photoshop you'll be fine with but in terms of video editing get an external hard drive that's the best recommendation I can say because that will save you so much headache of it starting to run low on memory because believe me if you start putting video files on here and editing with them and then you're wanting to render them out as well before you post them it will take up a lot of space uh, probably to the point where it might not even do the video for you because if you can imagine the amount of space it will take for the files then the files again in the editor and then the render of the final cut that you're doing it takes up a lot of space so a godsend is the external hard drive if you're going to do it get an external hard drive I travel with this, it's robust, it's easy to use. I'll put a link in the description below where I got it from, from Amazon, and it's absolutely, value-wise, something that is definitely needed. But the hub here is even more important, because that way you can plug your memory cards in, you can plug your traditional USB memory sticks in, and accessories in, because bear in mind, unless you're replacing everything, this only uses USB-C. So you can need something to expand it and that hub I found on Amazon and it's absolutely awesome. So anyway, that's a real quick update of what I'm thinking about this MacBook Pro. Bottom line, I love this device, I love this computer. 
it is something that I am using regularly, it makes my life easier. Uh, and not just because I like Apple products, but because it does what I want. I'm not waiting, everything is there when you want it. Everything is optimised and it is so fast. So fast. Even using Office documents, when we're doing word processing, spreadsheets, PowerPoints, everything is there when I want it. And that's all I can ask for on a computer. I don't want to be waiting for things to load up. I don't want to be waiting for things to process. And with this, I'm not. Why I waited for so long to get one. I should have just done it years ago. <laughs> so thanks very much for watching. Please hit the subscribe button if you're not already. Hit that like button if you like this update. It was a real quick update. It wasn't an in-depth one. It was just my views on what this thing is like and its performance. And it performs better than I was expecting. It really is awesome. Absolutely awesome. I'll see you real soon for another video. Bye.